Hey dolls, what's up? It's me, Miss Quiet. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I'm Miss Quiet, and you can make yourself at home, okay? There are drinks in my fridge. I'm gonna put your coats on my bed, get comfy, because today, today I'm gonna be reviewing this synthetic wig that Calis sent to me. So this is another affordable wigs for baddies video. So let's get right into it. Okay, so, so a seller on Amazon has sent me this wig, and it is from Calis, 100% premium synthetic wigs. And also they gave me a discount code for you dolls. So if you like it, you can get 10% off. Make sure you use my discount code QUIET10, all lowercase, for 10% off of your order, okay? But I'm itching, I'm absolutely itching to open this. Look at this. Guys, look at this. Look at these braids, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Here is what it looks like. They have the card on the front care advice card okay so this temperature can only go up to temperature 180 that's what the card looks like and then let me sit on my lap for a second the back of the bag has the hair care instructions on it they also sent me a nude wig cap so that's very generous of them and it's got two in it this has absolutely caught my attention i have never done a wig that's already braided on top before i'm just excited this is beautiful i'll probably never take her out of this style guys oh my gosh this is stunning guys this is like beautiful absolutely beautiful okay so the cap construction it has a lots of combs okay this is the most combs i've seen in a minute cap construction has let's see one comb on the side another comb on this side and then it's got one two combs on the front and one big comb in the back it also does have adjustable straps as well so i'm very excited to put her on so i'm gonna go ahead and plop her on my head Ugh. also guys please look at how pretty these curls are in the back like wow and this ombre wow this is stunning guys this is absolutely stunning okay now so this is her just sitting on my head i'm excited to get this lace off it does come with some baby hairs on here too so that's awesome this is gonna be an interesting look okay so i'm gonna go ahead and get started in the process of putting this wig onto my big old head okay and we'll come back Okay, dolls, so what's up? I'm back with the wig on, okay. So what do you think? Guys, this wig is stunning. Like, stunning. Like, this is just a quality wig. This is a seriously underrated wig, if you ask me. And I'm not a fan of red. It doesn't really match most of my clothes, which is why I don't usually do red hair. But I'm really happy I did red with this one because like, wow, this color is just beautiful. Absolutely stunning. And the braids are beautiful. They're very firm. Um, the hair is lovely. It feels very nice. It doesn't tangle too much. Tangle a little bit around the nape of the neck, but that's about it. My braids are super duper poopy right now. And um, it just barely got on my head. I would say it's probably borderline big head friendly. So if you think your head is huge, I don't know. 
about this wig i would have your hair as flat as possible under it but for the fact how big my braids were they're pretty big they're pretty chunky today so i think it would be okay the hairline was kind of hard to blend i tinted it put it on my head and then i cut it and then i tinted it again and then you're gonna have to do baby hairs to like help hide that because otherwise it's not very a gradual hairline at all it just kind of starts but i feel like it looks fine i'm totally gonna get away with this Okay, so guys, what do you think? Let me know. I think it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's a wig from behind. So where does it go? It goes all the way down to like my lower back. It looks it's got a little bun in the back too. I kind of want to take this bun out though because I want to turn it on and a half up, half down. So I'm going to do that right now. I will do that after I take the pictures, the thumbnail, so in case it looks like wacky. That way I still got the thumbnail pictures out of the way. And then I'll do that and I'll include it in the beginning. So honestly, this whole conversation right now is irrelevant because you would have already seen like that. But I like it a lot, guys. I highly suggest this a lot. I swear this is my honest opinion. I'm really very pleasantly surprised. Very pleasant surprised very very pleasantly surprised like i don't know how you kind of like this this is super duper cute super different too like ooh, i feel cute as heck i love it guys it came with a bobby pin in it so like a little free gift <laughs> a bobby pin yay it has not shattered since i put it on my head and um tangling let's see a little bit but not crazy like that's not anything unmanageable you just don't need to be running your hands through it i would say just keep your hands out of it and you'll be fine it's not just a point of tingling where like you could take it out of the bag and it's like already absurdly tingling like the big expected amount of tingling i definitely wouldn't say that you shouldn't buy this wig because of the tingling i will keep you guys updated on this wig absolutely stunning i don't think she comes with a name so we gotta name her ourselves so you guys let me know what we should name her in the comment section down below okay but yes i'm gonna wrap this video up right here i guess because I mean, I don't have anything else to say right now. So let me go pick a favorite comment of the day so I can go eat some Texas toast. This is my favorite comment of the day because I wanna share this plug with everybody. So Crystal Rivera, she said, this may sound gross and I thought so too at first, but if you put your jewelry, a brass and ketchup for 10 minutes and scrub with a toothbrush, then rinse off of room temperature tap water, you know how clean it comes out. I did it on a pair of earrings my cousin gave me that she had for like two years. She didn't clean them though. And when I cleaned them with ketchup, let me tell you, they came out spotless, a little discoloration, but that was it. So that might have just changed a bunch of baddies life. Girl, thank you so much. We're gonna try that and I will come back to you and we'll see what happens. I'll just try it. I don't know if my jewelry's brass or not, but I'll try it on some cheap AliExpress jewelry. That's seen better days and I will come back to you guys. Cause see, I always thought it was like coating coming off. I didn't think it was something you could clean off. I thought it was like coating rubbing off. So I don't know if this applies to me or not, but we're gonna find out okay. So yeah, that's my favorite comment today. Thank you, Crystal, for sharing. We super duper appreciate it. I love you all so much and I'll see you in the next few days, okay? Bye.